Every minute of the day, an average of 62 children need medical treatment at one of the 170 Children's Miracle Network hospitals around the world. Here in Kelloland, that includes Sanford Children's Hospital in Sioux Falls. Tonight, Kelloland TV is teaming up with Sanford to help give hope to those children and their families, and you can help make a miracle happen too. Erin Sanderson is with the Children's Miracle Network at Sanford's mean. Children's Hospital. She's joined by Mindy and Avery Hill, a Children's Miracle Network family. They're here to explain why you should make time to watch the Kelloland CMN special tonight at 6.30 p.m. Thank you guys so much for being here. Absolutely. Thanks for having us. Erin, let's start with you. Let's talk about the background with Sanford and the Children's Miracle Network. Sure. So, like you said, there's over 170 Children's Miracle Network hospitals in all of North America, which is pretty incredible to know there's that many hospitals helping local kids. And we are so blessed to have our CMN hospital right here in our backyard at the Castle of Care, Sanford Children's Hospital. Uh, so we have been a CMN hospital since the late 80s uh, mm -hmm. and just able to serve as many local families as we can with the, the help and support of donors. So how are the fundraising dollars used to help these families? Yeah, uh, an incredible thing is 100% stays local. 100%? Uh, 100% wow. of every dollar that's raised in any capacity for Children's Miracle Network at Sanford is going to stay right here in our community um, and right in our local communities and in the, in the Kelloland listening and viewing area, which is great. Um, so the funds go th to direct family assistance. So families that are going to and from appointments, surgeries, they're, they're going to and from the castle a lot. So we're able to help with uh, gas mileage, meal vouchers, things okay. that just kind of make that stay a little bit easier and all the travel a little easier. Then we have specialized programs called uh, Child Life, Social Work, Pediatric Chaplaincy, uh, lots of summer camps for kids that we pay for at no cost. They're non-billable services to our families, which is another great thing. And then a lot of the equipment that we have at Sanford Children's Hospital. Uh, we always say when you go to a normal children's hospital or a normal hospital, you're going to be cared for. Uh, mm -hmm. You have to be cared for. But when you go to a CMN hospital, it's kind of that top-notch level of care and the, the best possible pieces of life-saving equipment that we can offer thanks to CMN funding. That's amazing. Yeah. Now, Mindy, how has the Children's Miracle Network been there for you and Avery and your family? Yeah, so Avery was born 11 weeks premature. And so um, she went to the NICU right away after she was born and was there for 64 days. Um, we were, I mean, just covered as far as, you know, like meals. They gave us um, vouchers for the cafeteria. I was on a special diet when I was there. And so having those meal vouchers was incredibly helpful and in sticking to that and making sure that she got, you know, the type of stuff that she needed for me. Um, and then they also had, I mean, the best, the latest, the greatest um, equipment there to help care for her um, right when she came into the world up to the day she, that she left. So, and, and what is their support meant to you? Um, you know, it's, it's a support for our whole family, even mm -hmm. to this day. I mean, there's um, families. Um, this great team that works with CMN has been so incredibly helpful to us. Um, the families that we've met have been so supportive. Um, it's like a family. It's, it's been super, super helpful and kind of carrying us through our journey. And Avery, how old are you? I'm three. Three? That's awesome. What type of things does Avery like to do? Well, she loves to ride her horse, Peggy Sue. <laughs> and um, she just loves to play. She loves to color. Uh, she likes being a regular kid, uh, running around and playing, playing with friends and her cousins. And so, yeah, she loves that. That's so cool. Now, Erin, let's talk about the Kelloland Children's Miracle Network special, which airs tonight at 630. Yeah, so we do this every year. We partner, partner with Kelloland, and it's a beautiful partnership that we have. We've been doing it for many, many, many years. Uh, and this year we're dedicating a full half hour tonight from 6.30 to 7. And we're really just sharing, uh, we're kind of taking over the airwaves of <laughs> the, the message of miracles. Uh, mm -hmm. You'll tune in for that entire half hour and see uh, real tangible stories of kids that these dollars are helping. Because I think that's, that's hard sometimes to say. You're asked everywhere you go to, to donate in some capacity, whether it's rounding up your change or giving a larger donation. And this is the time that you can tune in and view who are, who are these dollars helping and, and where are they going to. So we're going to hear uh, from a lot of different local families that are going through a current um, battle, medical journey, maybe have just beaten cancer, mm -hmm. uh, lots of different diagnoses that we're just going to feature some of our amazing miracle families and talk about where those dollars are going. 
And you help families regardless of the diagnosis, correct? Absolutely. We see many, many, basically if you walk through the door of the children's hospital and you need to be seen for one reason or another, uh, we're able to help you through, the, like I said, the meal vouchers or just the fact that you're there with the programs, the services, the equipment. Um, we definitely don't discriminate if it's cancer, preemie baby, muscular dystrophy, diabetes, uh, genetic conditions, lots mm -hmm. of different things, and that's what we hope to, to feature tonight is just so you can see a wide range of the different um, things that we help with. What are some of the other stories that we'll be seeing tonight? Yeah, so Avery's story will be tonight, so you get to kind of hear a little bit more about her and how could you not fall in love with her when right. you see her, so you get to <laughs> see a little bit more into their journey tonight. Um, we have a little boy from Marshall, Minnesota that um, is dealing with a cancer diagnosis mm -hmm. and kind of getting a step into their journey. Um, we have the Chef Boys who are our CMN state champions, so they kind of rally behind us that they have such a rare genetic condition that there's not a name for it, which wow. is really, really unique. Uh, they're yeah. the only ones in the world that have it. So they live right here in our, <laughs> our viewing area. So we'll be featuring them, uh, some preemie stories, and then like I said, a little girl who just finished her treatment with cancer and is, mm. and is doing great. So lots of different things that we'll be able to see tonight. Let's talk about how people can help and donate tonight. Sure. So we have a new option this year where you can text to donate. So you don't have to, you can still be viewing and you don't have to mess around with picking up your phone and actually calling a phone <laughs> operator, God forbid, <laughs> calling a phone operator. So we um, have a text option. You can text KELLO to 51555 uh, and we'll shoot you a link right back and you can go online and donate. So it's a really cool thing. You don't have to do it right away. You can do it after the special so you okay. can enjoy watching the special the entire time. Uh, the best thing is that the, the Kello special will be back up online too, so you can watch it at any time, um, and that text option will be there. Uh, you can also join us on Sanford Children's Miracle Network on Facebook, and okay. we'll have other options of ways to donate. So the easiest one is that texting option or online. And that's available anytime? Yeah. Yep. Okay. That's going to be available anytime. All right. Well, thank you so much for being here. It was great meeting you, Avery. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> great. So definitely tune in tonight. Yeah. Thank you guys for being here.